Once again, welcome up, OG Trade Dean. You know what it is. The big general. Shout out to your boy Lil Go to Loke. Shit, man. I'm an insane nigga. But, you know, I got a lot of homies that bang for that dub, too. So, you know, we all affiliated at some point in your day. So shout out to that nigga. Go to Loke. Just finished watching that. that Snoop Dogg. GGN. That's what we call uh, video posted on World Star Hip Hop, yada yada yada. You know, good to see the homies back together and shit. You dig? Like, I missed that, missed that, that, that crip hop shit, man. That shit was live back in the G, man. Not a whole game, fabricated and shit. What's Snoop is like, Goldie, where you been? I know he wouldn't have been like, yo, cuz, I'm being held back by you with your 1% contract, you dig? Like, oh, hope my nigga free that nigga up on, on his contract, up, get that nigga some breathing space to go do what he do. Because absolutely right, man. What the game like right now is real gangster, gangster music. And they about to bring gangster music back. Oh, so I find it fucked up. That your boy Snoop totally bash your boy badass and shit. And I mean, like, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's kind of crazy that you know you fighting with fake gang members like like Ray J and shit. And I mean, like, no such thing as an R&B thug, nigga. Nate Dogg is dead, man. You go out them Chi Chi Man things, yo. I ain't a Chi Chi Man. I fuck with Ray J to a point still. But yeah, I don't know how you clown him badass. But I get attacked for you know speaking about this game for the Glock situation. You dig? Like, niggas act like personal business wasn't that shit back in the G. All the motherfucking collabos and features with your boy, man. Come on. Crazy. But, yeah, man, I, I, I just find it funny that, you know, this dude is like, yeah, you got your overseas fan base. Like, just directing them overseas. Like, come on. Like, come on, Snoop, man, you know how it feels to have your contract owned by another motherfucker. Because Suge was doing that shit to you, you dig? Your boy P had to motherfucking go and talk to your boy and buy you out. I mean, give you you, you your, your pathway and shit. But I ain't asking Snoop, I fuck with Snoop. Like, that's the, what, Doggy Style was my first rap album I ever listened to. It's corrupted my mind, I came from Jamaican culture, you dig? So it's like... I was all, it was all about clips on reggae at one point. Like, I didn't know nothing about American culture shit. Asking all these crazy questions. You know, I know that shit was funny as fuck when, like, it's your gas tank full of empty. Trade, he was like, just waiting for the nigga answer. Like, nigga, you know, it's fucked up when the homie over got a fucking car and shit. You know, they probably stripped the nigga for his license anyway, you dig, but like, Come on, the homies, big homies will be coming on to motherfucking Bentleys and shit, nigga. Like, real nigga shit. But, um, I really, when I, when I interview the big homie again, as well as go to look, I'm gonna find out, like, how this connection really happened, you dig? Because when I interviewed the big homie, like, he wasn't really expecting a reunion and shit, you dig? Like, you see the motherfucking video. And all your niggas are thinking about fake gangbanging. I be in the streets, dog. Just come see a nigga, man. Insane to the death of me. But yeah, um, fucking climbing Ray J. But I hope the big homie don't send them insane babies after you, nigga. But yeah, it, it, it was definitely something. It definitely had to been, you know, Goldie Loke reaching out to the big homie and shit. You dig? This new dog is too busy. You know, doing his thing. Snoop Dogg doing big things, you dig? Like, you see what, what Go Lok said, like, he, you know, he had a shit on his mind, and when he seen him at whatever location he said, you know, he brought it to his attention, you dig? Because, you know, he, he came out recently and said, like, you know, Snoop got him in a 1% contract. Like, the East Side, is, that went multi-platinum. Like, every every single was motherfucking hit. Club banging, street banging, like... East side of Snoop Dogg present the East Side as inducers and trades. Like, come on. That as he said, like like his his goal is to get back on top of the motherfucking game, bro. Like 
and nothing like that G Funk era. Like it's, it is what it is, though. But yeah, I ain't gonna go off and talk your head off. You is your boy, Crip Ron Paul, your favorite freedom fighter, favorite freedom fighter, thugging it everywhere. Shout out to my insane boys. Yeah. Uh, Crip Mount. Crip. Crip for Ron Paul is motherfucking Facebook. YouTube used to be the Instagram, but then Pussy Boy shut my shit down, so it's now revolutionary cuz. Gotta get back on the revolutionary shit you dig. Time to get back organized. Like, ain't no structure in this game no more. Niggas can't be banging without a purpose, you dig. But yeah, until next time, shit, stay tuned. A lot of big shit coming your way. No homo. I apologize for all the bad quality videos and shit. Just trying to keep the shit. Fed, I got all my equipment in another location, just stay tuned, you know this, how about your boy, yeah.